so let's get started with the exercise 4.1 for quadratic equations the question uh, says check whether the following quadratic which uh, check whether the following are quadratic equations or not okay so we are given uh, eight parts and we need to check the one by one which one is quadratic and which one is not right we have already discussed about what are quadratic equations right so we'll start with the part first here is given it is x plus 1 whole square equal to 2 times x minus 3 We can expand this thing x plus 1 whole square that's x square plus 1 square plus 2 1 and x that's 2ab and then you have 2x minus 6 done so you'll get x square as it is plus 1 plus 2x equal to 2x minus 6 it's 2x here right or we can just write this as x square plus 1 plus 2x we can just shift this thing to this side we get 2x 6 to this side we get positive 6 that is 0 right so we get x square plus 1 now 2x minus 2x that's gone so you get this thing and the final result that we will get is plus 7 equal to 0 which is of the form a x square plus b x plus c equal to 0 with a not equal to 0 so we can compare this uh, one with this and uh, we can see that the coefficient of x square here is not 0 which means implying that first is quadratic to aise humne chalte jana har kisi path pe aise simplify karna simplify karna short mein and then we need to check at the end whether the form is of this type or no theek hai let me do the part number second with different color and do it here only theek hai part number second is it is x square minus 2x equal to minus 2 times 3 minus x done so here you will get x square minus 2x that's equal to minus 6 plus 2x okay now this is x square this is minus 2x this 2x will be shifted so we will get minus 2x here this 6 will be shifted we will get plus 6 that's equal to 0 so x square minus 4x plus 6 right so you can just write which is all the form which is all the form ax square plus bx plus c equal to 0 where a is not equal to 0 so you can see again the coefficient of x square here is not 0 implying that second is quadratic right
10 so this is the part number second that means the one that was given in first and the one that's given in second both are quadratic equations now let's move to the uh, third and fourth one इसी करने को तो हम एक और स्लाइड पे इनको कर सकते हैं बट देन वी नीड टू जस्ट शिफ्ट दिस क्वेश्चंस देयर इट इज बी स्लाइडली डिफिकल्ट सो इट्स बेटर टू डू इट ऑन द स्लाइड ओनली राइट सो लेट मी Let me do the one here. Third one, that is. Now you see the third one is x minus two, x plus one. That's given to be equal to x minus one, x plus three. Okay, now the moment you simplify, you'll get x into x, x square, x into 1, that's x, minus 2 into x, that is minus 2x, minus 2 into 1, that's minus 2, equals x into x again, x square, x into 3, that is 3x, minus 1 into x, that is minus x, Minus one into three that will be minus three. Okay. Now you see, you can just write x square. This will be minus x. Then you minus two. Shift this thing to this side. You get minus x square uh, plus minus two x. This will be three x minus x. That will be two x. But the moment you shift it to the left hand side, it will be negative two x. And on the three. Will be shifted to the positive. That's equal to zero. Now you see, x square minus x square is gone. Minus x minus two uh, x is minus three x. Okay. Minus two plus three, you get plus one. Equal to zero. Uh, which is not quadratic. Take. Which is not quadratic, as you can see. Why? Because we can just plug in. We can just write it. Likhne ke liye toh maine se bhi likh sakte hain zero x square. If someone is saying that there should be x square in their equation, to likhne ke liye aise likh sakte hain. But the thing is that this will be quadratic when the coefficient of x square is non-zero. But here it is zero, so it's not a quadratic. Okay, so that's part number third. Let's take up the part number four. Let me write this one out. Uh, 